Hey guys, Cameron here. I know it's been a long while since I've been back, but I'm back now, and today I'm doing another movie review. Uh, today, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen the film I'm going to talk about, I suggest you go take a look at it now. It might be in cinema, I don't know. But uh, today I'm talking about Avengers Endgame. This has been a film that's been built up for 10 years in the Marvel Universe, and now with it 11 years later, we're finally getting a good Marvel film. Possibly, I hope, the last Avengers film. Uh, quick catch up. Um, previously, Thanos got all the Infinity Stones, snapped out the universe, and killed half the Marvel Cinematic Universe. In, in Endgame, I dare not spoil if they get everybody back, but I will say it's a good film to see, and every character, possibly because we've had 10 long years of knowing these people, and now everybody knows that Robert Downey Jr. is Iron Man, Mark Ruffalo is the Hulk, Scarlett Johansson is uh, Black Widow, Chris Hemsworth as Thor, and uh, Chris Pratt as Star-Lord. The list goes on. But Endgame is right now the most highest grossing Marvel film. And with Spider-Man Far From Home now out, I can't wait to see what happens next. So, with Spider-Man Far From Home, it's clear that Spider-Man comes back in Endgame. But it, it's a really good film, and especially because the villain in Infinity War was really good. Josh Brolin gave a stellar performance as Thanos, and in Endgame, he doubled his performance by triple. The climax of Endgame is so great, I dare not spoil it. So, I'm not going to. But, if there's one Marvel film I think everybody wants to see, it's probably Avengers Endgame. And if you do happen to go see it, I definitely suggest you bring a tissue. There are some sad scenes, and it's not pretty. So... My final thoughts on Avengers Infinity Endgame is I give it a 10 out of 10 and a full Infinity Gauntlet full of Infinity Stones. So, if you, by the way, if you guys have seen my new Mario videos, this is going to be a new thing I'm starting. The Mario Adventure series. And there's also going to be other little Mario videos. I'm currently really trying to get... I'm fully really trying to work on a new project for my next idea, a parody of one of the most greatest and possibly best musical films ever created. So please check that out. But until then, I'm Cameron Nichol. Like, favourite, subscribe, and do check out the rest of my channel if you are new, and I'll see you guys later. Good on fellow lads, and I'll see you in the next video.